guys not gonna start my video back to St. Lucy Parish Church looking down towards Babs Road I'll lead you back to the Arawak cement plant I'm about to check a hall six mains pipe stone and half move for it <coughs> I'm back to St. Peter as well and this is all the Charles Duncan on new highway Yes, guys, heading back up towards St. Lucy Parish Church in the Barbados Dayton Power Hydroelectric Hydro Generational Generational Voltaic Plant or something like that. Solar Hydro Voltaic Plant. And all can ground over here. So I'm in the countryside at, at the moment. <coughs> To the north of the island in the parish of St. Lucy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you look the power of hydro voltaic generation plant. Let's go back up to St. Lucy Parish Church. So, St. Lucy is to the north of the island. There's only parish bordering St. Lucy. The only parish bordering St. Lucy will be St. Peter. St. Lucy and St. Peter are the two northernmost parishes on the island. So I'm far out today. Okay, I'm going. <clears throat> and the Barbados Little Power Hydro Voltaic Generation Plant. Or something like that. Looking back down to Bob's Bourbon Road, that leads about the Chaco Hall, the Arabat Cement Plant, and so on. So, this is the Charles Duncan only highway. Named after national hero Charles Duncan O'Neill, who was born in 1879 and died in 1936. He was born in the parish of St. Lucy. The Charles Duncan O'Neill Highway starts at Portland in St. Peter and will end at Chaco Hall in St. Lucy. So, this is the road of St. Lucy Parish Church. So if you are coming from Chaco Hall side, <coughs> The barbarous, barbarous little power solar photovoltaic generation plant. And then back up to St. Lucy Parish Church. See the chimney for the Fair Fee Plantation. So St. Lucy is also the birthplace of the right excellent Earl Walton Barrow, who was Barbados's first Prime Minister, father of independence and national hero. <coughs> Earl Barrow led us into independence on the night of the 30th of November 1966 at the Garrison Savannah, downtown, <coughs> which is south of Bridgetown, the Garrison Historic Area and UNESCO World Heritage Site. He was the first Prime Minister and he was the founder of the Democratic Labour Party in 1955. 
after he and Sir Grantley Adams had their dis differences, he left the Barbados Labour Party. Sir Grantley Adams is also a national hero as well, who formed the Barbados Labour Party in 1938. So the two main parties in Barbados, political parties, is the Barbados Labour Party, the BLP, and the Democratic Labour Party, the DLP, founded by two national heroes. Sir Grantley Herbert Adams founded the Barbados Labour Party, and Errol Barra founded the Democratic Labour Party. Errol Barra was born at Fairfield in St. Lucie on the 21st of January 1920 and then he died on the 1st of June 1987. <clears throat> St. Lucie is the only female parish in Barbados and it differs from all the other parishes. You know, heading back to St. Lucy Parish Church. At Nestfield, St. Lucy. Same board, old city church. Point a list of the list of places and cloth and access for the roundabout, showing you how to use the roundabout and which direction to turn. So this is the William Donald George Parish Center for St. Lucy Parish Church, and this is St. Lucy Parish Church here again. Theodore Banker on the boat and this is St. Lucy Parish Church again and the William Donald George Parish Center which is named after the former priest of the church Reverend Curtis Goodridge who is the current priest is also a relative of mine here at St. Lucy's the board giving the terms of services at St. Lucy Parish Church That's good, you see a door, banker on the boat. And St. Lucy Parish Church here. This is at Nestfield in St. Lucy. It can be with the area here at St. Lucy Parish Church, where St. Lucy Parish Church is located, can be referred as Nestview, Bourbon, or 
fear of fear. Other bike around the boat. So this way over here will lead you back to us. You want to map highway, you want to highway to way via the charge down come on the highway as well, via Portland, Mile Quarter, and Parish of St. Peter, St. Lucie, and St. James. Banker on the boat. St. Lucy Parish Church here. Once again, which dates back to 1629, it was built and rebuilt several times until it was built the last time in 1837. St. Lucy and the mural graphic on the church wall here. So this way now we lead about a fair few for your Mount Gear, Rum Distillery, by the Jersey Hill and Church Hill. And this is St. Lucy's Parish Church here, the side of the church. This way now takes you back to the Animal Flower Cave, Pi Corner, Jersey Hill, all in St. Lucy. And fair few and the oil. And the Mount Gear Ram Distillery and so on is all this way. Mount Gear Ram Distillery, which is the oldest Ram Distillery in the world, and in Barbados. You can even smell the rum from here. St. Lucy Parish Church here once again. Look at that Bourbon St. Lucy. Chimney for the old fair field plantation and sugar factory. And all up in here is Jersey Hill and Mount View and Rock Hall and the Meridian Windows Company here. So thank you guys for watching now and have a blessed evening.